Claude Waugh was born and raised in Quebec. The decision to uh, go into medicine was strongly influenced by uh, uh, family ties with the grandfathers and three uncles who were also in the profession. So I remember distinctly that as a youngster, I made rounds with my grandfather who was a psychiatrist in Quebec City. And um, my other grandfather took me to his operating room, which was adjoining his office uh, at the Hotel Zier Hospital in Quebec City. So I had uh, not much choice but to go into medicine. And I uh, salute their influence because uh, uh, this is uh, a profession which I, uh, I have loved all my life. He's really one of the founders, godfathers, and spirits of pediatric gastroenterology. There was no such thing as pediatric gastroenterology. There was no specialty. The specialty did not exist. And then he not only became a pediatric gastroenterologist, but he formed the field. He wrote with the professor Arnold Silverman de Denver, Colorado. Le premier livre de gastroenterologie pédiatrique, c'est que nous, entre guillemets, on considérait notre Bible. Dr. Roy also uh, was a powerful voice uh, for the role and the place of clinician scientists, clinician researchers in the modern academic health centers. He was always fully dedicated to research. However, for Dr. Roy, clinical practice, teaching, and research are all one, inseparable. He's obviously a leader, but a leader with a clear vision of what has to be done. Dr. Roy is a player of the team, he's a captain, and he wants that all the players give the maximum, but, of course, he always follows by example. He really brought the laboratory to understanding not only existing diseases and conditions related to the intestinal tract, but also in defining new areas never before defined. That long tradition of the clinician scientist, there's no one, no one more appropriate uh, to represent those individuals at class than Dr. Waugh. He has trained more leaders in the field than I think anyone else I can name. And these people who are now leaders in gastroenterology are leaders in Canada, leaders in the United States, leaders in Switzerland, Belgium, France, worldwide. Well, you know, I wish someone had told me at the beginning of my career that I would still be seeing patients, teaching students, and doing research at the age of 84. And it's really amazing that since his retirement, his so-called retirement, he's never retired and I don't think he will, uh, he's continued to make major contributions in pediatric gastroenterology. It's quite clear that the research virus has integrated into my genome and it's an addiction and it's not curable. <laughs> Distinguished clinician scientist, renowned medical author, internationally recognized mentor, founder, and subspecialty pioneer. Ladies and gentlemen, Canadian Medical Hall of Fame laureate, Dr. Claude Waugh.